There's the windup, and boom! Oh! Five o'clock in the morning, Thursday, would be criminals try to break into a business in Livonia. But the only business that got hurt was. It's just kind of funny that the guy kind of got what he deserved. The alarm woke up Joel Swisher, the owner of Uncoiled Firearms and Gun Range on Schoolcraft near Middle Belt. He looked at the video. I had him pretty good, so. It was the leg, but it was also kind of close to the, you know what? Absolutely. You think he's hurt? He could be. <laughs> I mean, you saw the video that. Yeah. In fact, workers at Uncoiled wanted to review the video, too. Did you guys check local hospitals for this guy? We have. We didn't come up with him at all. Well, maybe he wasn't hurt. In fact, nobody was hurt. In fact, they didn't even get inside. But in fact, they got away. He's not very smart. And if criminals really wanted to get a gun, they would have to avoid security, avoid alarms, avoid video, and more. First, he would have had to get through this door. He started there. But then he'd have to go through. This door is locked. He'd have to get through that somehow. Then he'd have to go through the classroom. He'd have to break into this door, which is also locked. Then he's in the gun display place. He probably would have wanted a pistol. Here it is. He'd have to go here, break this glass. That's a lot of work for a gun. It's not quite as easy as everybody thinks. I say so. But Lavon you please not giving up we're gonna break that and go frame by frame and we're gonna solve this Livonia PD is the best they're good but we broke down the video frame by frame and it kind of looks now like he may have dropped the brick before the brick hit him in the whatever but just thinking about the possibility kind of hurts I kind of got pains in my stomach from uh, where he possibly got struck at <laughs> In Livonia, Charlie Langton, Fox 2 News.